In this video, I turned all Trash Taste members into VTubers, and it went pretty horrible. So, in my last few uploads where I created some Photoshoppy goodness, I was always trying to create a satisfying end product and was pretty serious about the end result. But today, we are going absolutely insane, balls through walls, because today we're going against both human rights and the Geneva Convention in one foul swoop. Instead of turning VTubers into something realistic, we're going to turn something realistic into a VTuber. And you know me, I'm the most notorious, biggest trash taste hater there is. So much so that I watched every episode multiple times and I bought every item in their merch shop just to remind myself that I'm a better human being than they are because I like so make pizza with a crust on it. Thank you very much. Yeah, why like why does crust on pizza exist and why does everyone pretend it that it's good? It tastes good. No, it doesn't. So to give our three protagonists here an ounce of sense, we're inserting some of the DNA of the most eloquent VTuber group using Photoshop. Holy shit, this guy is hot as fuck. This guy looks like my brother. Wait. Wait, wait. Let's get to it, shall we? First off, we got Joseph the Manga Lad, and we are going to mix him with Haruka, since she tortured him by making him play Jump King on stream, forging a truly deep bond with him. There is a name for this bond, I believe. It's called Stockholm Syndrome. So greetings and thanks to all Swedish people that live in Syndrome. So let's finally get started on the model, and what better first step than making Connor's nightmare real by inserting DNA of a deer into his best friend. Okay, now this just looks weird. So we had to send this abomination into the Arkham prison to get Joyce Joker arc started, I think. And just like we all learned from Tokyo Ghoul, imprisonment equals a fresh new haircut. Now this looks better, but we can make it even more frightening to piss off the Welshman and secure a spot on the next tier list of frightening animals, the deer horns. Bro Joey, I, I know you like the H manga stuff, but stop being horny for once in my videos. Insert button. Now another important thing about Haruka is her Canadian origins. And since Canada is my favorite Super Smash Bros map, we need to pay some tribute to the people living there with a nice warm scarf. Now let's make Joey's clothing green. By the way, this is a new nonsense design, you can pay me later Joey. And add some lights and filters and there you have it. First experiment succeeded. Next up in the virtual tube we have Gigek, the incest zone. And since he has the name, mixing him with family seems to be the appropriate choice. That's why we procured a DNA sample of Hime Hajime, his, wi his, his wife's granddaughter, yes. Not definitely not Sydney, his wife. I might have to restart the game. What? Why? 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 I gotta change my name. Oh, but... You're using your uh, grandma's account. <laughs> Now first off, we need to make him look like a certain Teen Titans character by reinforcing his thick British skull with some metal junk. Then we have to make his hair blonde. And let me just say this, this was no easy task. I had no idea how to do it, but I had a trump card. My favorite of the big three anime, Bleach. And here we go, blonde hair. Now everybody knows that there is nothing better than a British knockoff of something American. So ladies and gentlemen, with the next edit I present you British Dragon. Now let's change Garn's outfit a bit to match Hemis. And while it may not be better than the uniform of his alter ego, Steve Handjobs, it definitely matches more the rest of his attire. Now for the end, you know the drill. Put him into hell and add a filter or whatever. And there you go. Now for a last member, the most posh Brit, someone who raised an insane amount of money for challenge recently by just biking and being remembered as the most boomer person on Trash Taste. Of course, I'm talking about, say it with me, C C C C C C Chris Broad! What? You were expecting C Dog? Well, he kind of transformed himself in a VTuber already, and let's just say it's hard to improve perfection. But since it's no secret that Chris is in fact the fourth secret member of Trash Taste and the real identity of Iron Mouse, I thought it would be fitting to combine his VTuber persona with reality. Now luckily, we already made Iron Mouse realistic. Video in the description, shameless plug. So we can just cut her realistic hair off and place it on Mr. Affable himself. BAM! Now this already looks way too funny, but way too would dress him up. And before I show you, I need Need to put up a little disclaimer. The following piece of media could either make you die laughing or make you want to carve your eyeballs out and die that way. Or I guess both. Just keep in mind to subscribe after you get reincarnated into the new Isekai gang. And here you go. And oh my god, it's beautifully cursed. You know, this may be the most unrealistic version so far with his hair looking like that. Um, but, but I'm gonna be honest for a moment. Both you and I know you don't want that boy with more detail because, oh my god, my eyesight is in danger. And there you have it, finished with all three Trash Taste members and after seeing this, I can give you a pretty good simulation of what the next Trash Taste episode is going to look like. Where's the undo button? 